Now, there's a simple four letter proposal that's much more than simply a word. Are the four letters more handy than pint? It's as elegant as any you've heard. Hey up, perhaps should we pop for a pint? That's a perfectly posed proposition. One that's properly pulled off at pump in a pub. For me, it's an easy decision. And soon, that phrase will be back. That one for which many have yearned. Because it's all a spin more than just a pint. And we'll soon see our pubs are returned. It's a bond between a dad and his lad. Between two sisters or your partner in life. It's a post-work pint decompression. While you talk through days, graft and strife. A pint is a meeting of minds. It's comedy, culture and art. It breaks ice and builds bridges and all. It's an offer to make a fresh start. It's much more than simply a pint. It's a comforter on a first date. It's the perfect liquid accompaniment to a roast dinner. Filling your plate. An important meeting for business. Well, at least that's what I tell my wife. It's helping a mate in a time of their need. While you talk through their troubles in life. I wait find out more refreshing than first sup on a hot summer's day. Or in winter, when cosy bit fire, then it's warm comfort supping, I'd say. A celebration, invitation, or commiseration, it can hail a coming of age. Epic poems I've written while supping a pint, and then forgot what I put down on page. A free meal in a public house, they say, can turn out a bit dearest at day. But putting world to rights with a pint and your pals, it's brass well spent in that way. It's a symbol of recovery now. As we emerge from this chrysalis state, I can't wait to just ring up my pal. Does I fancy a pint, my old mate? Oh, why, grand is that?